What's going on guys? It's Jeff for Mad Hatter's Reef and today we're going to be taking a look at my coral unboxing from Tidal Gardens. Alright guys, so last week Tidal Gardens had their big September live sale and if you don't know what their live sale is, it's basically uh, they go coral to coral, close in shots and you see a little fan there's a little fan right where my hand is and he's basically talking interacting with people and they kind of have a really amazing sale once a month and i guess it runs for about a week i'm not exactly sure how long i went and checked the website out and most of the corals that they featured on that sale are are there's nothing there ho 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 i mean go to tile gardens and buy some coral if you want to Oh, but you're not going to find anything from the live sale. It's nothing there. So anyways, I jumped in and I've had my eye on a certain coral on Than's website for a while. And it happened to be in on this sale, so I jumped on it. And like you always do, when you buy a coral and you're going to pay $40 for shipping, you buy more coral, right? Yes, you can! So as the live sale is going on, I wrote down a couple items that I was interested in. And I picked up a total of six corals and uh, we're going to do a little bit of a unboxing from when everything got to me. One thing before we jump into that, if you want to learn how to win this light, stay tuned to the end of the video and I'm gonna give you directions as to how you can win this light, the Aqua Knight LED Nano Reef Tank Light. So, if this is your first time being here and you love saltwater aquariums like I do, gently press that subscribe button in the face. All right guys, so I got my package on a Tuesday and I was at work, so I had to run home at lunch and do this for you. I definitely wanted to get this on film, uh, so thankfully uh, the boss let me go home so I could make this video. And there was a little handwritten note in there from Than thanking me for a super chat during the live sale. And I was really excited. This is something that I wanted to do. I wanted to buy corals from Than for a while. And if you guys want to check out uh, some more details on some of the corals that I picked up, there is a video that will be in the description that kind of goes over some of the good SPS beginner corals that Than offers. So I was a little nervous of getting corals on this day. It was really warm. I believe it topped like 90 degrees, and that's just incredibly unseasonable here in Maine. Usually we're starting to get those cooler nights and mid-70 days. It's usually perfect weather to be buying coral. And we had a little bit of a heat wave this past week. But even with that, all the coral arrived very healthy. And I bought a total of six corals, uh, mainly due to just two corals that he had in the live sale that I really wanted. And the two corals were the blue pavona coral that he has on his website, as well as the ultra leptoceros, which is very similar to a jack-o'-lantern, uh, but the green is much more pronounced in this coral. Another great thing is Than uh, labels everything so you know exactly what coral is what, which is really helpful for new people that are just getting into the hobby and don't exactly know what coral is what yet. Some of the other corals that I got from Than were the Grape Monipora, the Pink Postulopora. I also got a Green Postulopora and a Hollywood Stunner Chalice. And Than has a unique way of shipping corals. I've have been seeing a lot of people start using these urine sample cups uh, but he goes the extra mile and puts a bag and clamps a bag and he also takes a piece of styrofoam and he puts he puts the plug into that hole and floats a coral upside down and what this does is prevents the corals from smashing into the sides of the container i'm not going to get into dipping corals because i've covered this in another video and i'll include that in the description if it's something that you want to check out I do have a pretty extensive process and it does work for me uh, and there's been times where I haven't dipped corals and I've paid the price so I dip everything that goes into my tank regardless of who it's coming from.
was a shot of the Hollywood Stunner once it got into the tank. And this is a few days later. Uh, definitely happy with this coral. It was something I just grabbed randomly. I've had them in the past and in the nano reef tank, and I let the re nano reef tank go to hell, uh, so I lost that coral. Here's a shot of this pink polysilopora, and this coral was extending its polyps within minutes of being in the tank. So I put it in the mid section of the tank because I know Than runs T5s, and I didn't want to burn it up with my LEDs that I have on the tank currently. Originally, I only bought this coral because it was $15 on the live sale, but it has quickly become one of my favorites out of the group. The next coral is the whole reason why I placed the order to begin with, and it is the blue Pavona coral. And this coral is absolutely gorgeous. This shot does not do this coral justice. It is definitely a deep blue base with light sky blue polyps. And I put it on this little frag plug just in hopes that it starts to encrust. The next coral is the last one that went into the tank, and it's my Idaho Grape Monipora. And this section of the tank I kind of want, it's where the drop-off is, and I kind of want the Monipora's to grow out over it. Here's a shot of the Ultra Leptoceras coral. It's very similar to the Jack-O-Lantern, but it has very more pronounced green within it. Really gorgeous coral. And this last one is the green Pocillopora, which I'm not exactly sure what happened to it because it looked absolutely healthy when I put it into the tank. But within like five minutes, it basically just started dying. This shot is about five days later. There are some sections of it that I'm going to try to save and I'll let you guys know how I make out with that. All right, guys, so that is my coral grab from Tidal Gardens. I have a couple other vendors that I want to get some corals from just to have in the tank. And I'm going to leave that for a surprise in the upcoming video. All right, so if you want to win that Aquanite 30-watt LED nano reef tank light, all you need to do is go to the link below. It's going to take you to the video where I did the product review. Watch the product review. Hit the subscribe button for Premium Aquatics. Hit the like button on the video and leave a comment as to why you would like to see this light on your aquarium. Pretty easy to do. Next week on Mad Hatter's Reef, I will be announcing the winner. And good luck to everybody that throws a name in the hat. Don't let your dreams be dreams. So that aside, something else that we're going to be doing is I'm going to be doing a monthly raffle for all of my patrons. So if you want to put your name in the hat for a monthly drawing, which could be anything from a new protein skimmer to new lighting. So if you want to be involved in that, check the link out below for my Patreon account, become a supporter, become a part of Salt Nation, and you could win. That's gonna do it for today, guys. I will see you next time. Same reef time, same reef channel. Peace.